Hi guys, so I thought I'd pop on and do a very quick video. I was online the other night there and I got an email from Makeup Revolution to say that the mystery bags were back. Um, so of course I had to go on and spend £35 and get myself a mystery bag. And um, I don't think I'm going to be disappointed. So if you bear with me, I'm going to open this now. I've taken all the packaging off um, so I know what's inside but I can't wait to show you. Um, yeah, I am loving this. I am loving this mystery bag. I really am. Um, yeah, there's lots of things. I don't have any of it, to be honest with you. So it's always a worry, isn't it? But because you've got so much makeup revolution that you're going to have it. So I'm going to keep my favourite item to last. So the first item in here is a stippling brush. Now, it's not a very stiff stippling brush. I've got a MAC one and I've got another Revolution one that, that's more kind of stiffly, if that's a word I'm looking for. It's more stiff, um, but it's a decent brush, you know. I'm doing the old kind of try and pull the hairs out and nothing's coming out, which is really good. And I love the fact that it comes in this as well. So that's another brush. You can never go wrong with a brush. So I was pleased to see that in there. The next item that was in here is a Revolution Pro lipstick and it's in the colour Venture. Now this is dark brown and um I kinda is it maybe like a kind of cinnamony colour, but it's just too dark for me. So that will be popping in a giveaway box. There we go. So I'm not swatching it for that reason because I'd hate to swatch something and not be able to give it away to somebody. You know what I'm like, I love giving stuff away. This cute little palette, the unicorn, I Heart Revolution Unicorn palette. This look at the packaging on it though. How cute is that? And I'm going to open it up and I'm going to show you the colours in here. So each colour is so girly. Each colour is embossed with a unicorn. I mean, how cute is that? Jeffrey Star can eat your heart out there, eh? Um, as, you know, actually, I have been working all day today and the post here arrived with this about three o'clock and I thought... Today was one of these days I didn't have any video calls, so I shot up the stairs like lightning. <laughs> Had a shower, um, put my makeup on and thought I am definitely filming this so everybody can see it and get their get a chance to get their hands on it and see what's in mine. Um, so yeah, when I saw they were back, I was blown away. I think I am going to start trying things like the face masks and the skincare because I've got too many palettes and I hate to say that, but I have far too many palettes. Now, this next item, look at the packaging. I mean, their packaging is just fantastic. And it's absolutely gorgeous. So this is a jelly highlighter. I It's called Monumental. Oh, that's the same colour as my um, reloaded highlighter that I got in my haul. There we go. So that's a coincidence. And I'm going to show you this. It's like molten metal. Absolutely gorgeous. Now the light might not pick this up. <laughs> oh, it's like jelly. To, it's like jelly to touch. It's like wobbly like jelly. Um, sorry, I'm such a child. Right, so I'm going to swipe that there. Look at that. Now, of course, you blend it in. It leaves a beautiful shine. Now, I think that would be really pretty. You know, if you were on holiday, if you wanted to put some shimmer on the top of your shoulders. Now, this is the one thing I saw and I got really excited when I saw it, when I pulled everything out. Um, it is a chocolate bar, I Heart Revolution chocolate bar and golden, it's a golden bar. And it is one that I do not have. I've got loads of the chocolate bar palettes, but I don't have this one. So you can imagine how, I don't have anything that's come in this mystery bag, which is good. Look at this. I must admit, I am probably more blown away by the packaging of the new ice, um, the black ice and the glass mirror. The packaging on those palettes are amazing. But their packaging is just getting better and better. But this packaging was the first kind of packaging of Revolution that I loved, the chocolate bar. And um, I just love the chocolate bar palettes. Even if I just look at them, to be honest with you, and I never use them, I probably would never get rid of my chocolate bar palettes. So the colours, again, are um, kind of a bit more of an old-fashioned palette in that they're on the plastic. However, I've had quite a few palettes 
and those nude ones that I showed you that don't have the colours on them and this comes with the sponge applicator but look at the colours and a full mirror which is great. Now these are my everyday colours, um, there's a choice of shimmers and it is all shimmers actually, shimmers and crisp pigments. Um, yeah. So there's no mattes in here, which is interesting. Usually there's a couple of mattes in a palette. Unless I am missing them completely, they all look like shimmer and pressed pigments to me. But anyway, I will swatch these for you, but I'll just do it in another video. I like doing the swatching palette videos separately. So that way, if you want to search for a Revolution product, it, it's up front if that makes any sense so I could do it all in the one video but then if somebody wanted to search for the golden bar palette then you know they would have to wade through the whole video where if you do it up front it's quite a short video for me um but I don't mind it gives me something to put out as well but I really need to um cut back on the palettes because this is ridiculous but I love these ones um, yeah, so I think the next time I see a, a mystery bag, you must spend £35. <laughs> I'll probably, I'm not going to say I'm not going to do it because I will, but I will probably look at skincare and face masks and setting sprays and different things like that rather than the eyeshadow palettes because there does come a limit to the amount of eyeshadow palettes that one can have. Anyway, I'm going to show you again what I got. So I got the stippling brush. I got the Revolution Pro lipstick. I got the Revolution um, Jelly Highlighter, which is gorgeous. I got the Unicorn Palette, which I love. Again, it would make a gorgeous wee stocking filler. Um, this is the danger. That's outside of the box now. And I got the I Heart Revolution Golden Bar. So it's gorgeous. I mean, I think the only reason you would need to know the colours is if you were trying to get somebody to copy what you were doing. Um, you know, you could just save the third shade alone or whatever. But it does kind of help. So they're kind of all chocolate bar, uh, golden bar. Um, so there's foil, wrapper, limited, cocoa, beans, chocolatier, um, block box bar, golden ribbon, edible tablet wrapped collection and wrapper and gift. So yeah, they're all very much chocolate bar kind of shade names, aren't they? So anyway, guys, let me know what you think. Are you going to go on to Makeup Revolution and spend £35? Or are you kind of over these mystery bags at the moment? I am dying to see if others get different things um, or if it's all the same. Um, some people might say that this is a way of Makeup Revolution getting rid of their old um, stock. And in a way, it probably is. But... I don't have these palettes and I'm always really excited to get, you know, a freebie. Um, <laughs> even if I have to spend £35 to do it, which is quite easily done, to be honest with you. But I will do more skincare um, and different bits and pieces going forward in these hauls. So thank you very much for watching. If you're going to pop onto the Revolution makeup site, let me know what you buy. And as I say, I will be swatching these palettes um, in individual videos to come. So take care and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.